Hello and welcome to another show and tell. This time it's about uh, Civil Power, a game by Brian Train, BTR Games, Brian Train Games 2013. Uh, it's not an unbagging or unboxing for that matter. Well, it came in a bag, but um, I've uh, unbagged this one uh, off camera um for quite a some time now uh i was planning to do a show and tell but um i was caught in uh, other stuff and um uh, didn't uh, really have time and stuff like that but uh, uh the story of this game um, i mean not the true story of this game i don't really know the story of this game but the the story of it arriving to me is um uh, quite uh, peculiar. Uh, it uh, it uh, mixes my stupidity with uh, uh, my uh, incessant curiosity and uh, and uh, very good uh, uh, I don't know attitude and uh, openness of uh, of the uh, designer of this game, uh, which. Uh, uh, is uh, by chance one of my uh, favorite designers um, I thought that this game was a print and play game I've seen it uh, on a group on Facebook I've seen the uh, bit of a map and then I said oh nice what an intriguing little game and I said okay let's let's go uh, see it on the uh, on the designer's web page, uh, there was a game. It cost uh, a very moderate amount of money, and I said, "Okay, uh, I've sent the money to the designer and uh, said, look, uh, I've purchased the game and uh, so and so." And I thought I would receive the the print and play uh, files because uh, it wasn't it was rather cheap uh, uh, so uh, even by my standards i'm not really a uh, well-to-do uh, guy but um, i said okay uh, it, it costs about uh, uh, the price of a uh, uh, regular print and play uh, game but then the author said, "Look, <laughs> I, I think I, uh, I think you uh, misunderstood me. I don't send print and play files." And I went back and I said, uh, and I realized, yes, I made a mistake. <laughs> it was uh, stupid for me to do this. Uh, uh, and I said, "Okay, um, well, um, I was very, I was worried because I live in a country where uh, international post." Um, is kind of tricky and uh, uh, I happen to still uh, wait for a, a, a an envelope or a parcel or, so, or something like that sent by GMT games uh, very nice of them to send me they weren't supposed to I mean they didn't have to uh, I had a, a a single card missing from a second-hand GMT game I, I wrote to them uh, asking for uh, I don't know a picture of it to uh, to print and play uh, to print it uh, and uh, replace it and they said okay we we'll send you and this was years ago and uh, I believe it, it's because of the post office in my country but long story short I said well that's about it <laughs> maybe I'll see it maybe I don't the game I uh, this game um, well sure enough in about one week which was uh, which was uh, I don't know. I left me awestruck because I said no way this could happen. Coming from Canada in one uh, in one week, no problems in my mailbox. I said, wow, this has never uh, uh, it, this has never happened to me. Uh, I said, okay. Um, well, long story short, it was in my mailbox. Nice uh, in this. Uh, um, in this, uh, uh, I mean, not only this, it, it, there was another envelope, but it, it was in this uh, bag. Uh, I had this uh, 
piece of paper, very nice civil power, uh, perhaps better uh, to have called it, I don't know, civil unrest or civil uh, disorder, <laughs> but it's civil power. Um, it, I had two maps, uh, which I uh, um, I uh, laminated and uh, cut the to the smallest size possible. Um, I really like this because even with two the, the two maps uh, side by side, we have a little glare here, but otherwise it's uh, rather okay. It has a very small footprint which I like, I, I don't really have uh, uh, too much space, I I would love to play a monster game sometime, but uh, I have to remove uh, furniture from uh, one of the rooms to <laughs> to be able to do that, so um, it, it's uh, okay this way. Uh, then I had a, a, a label uh, sheet, a sheet of label paper, with the counters, but um, it uh, was starting to flake off. I mean, the 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 uh, the ink on it was starting to flake off. Uh, there are some there are some. Uh, let's see if I can focus. Uh, you see, there are points there or. Maybe this one, yes. See, uh, and that's not this uh, on this label paper, but on the the original one. So uh, uh, I'm sorry, <laughs> I'm sorry to uh, say this. Uh, I usually don't do this, but I had to um, to scan the counter sheet, and then uh, I printed uh, a different uh, uh, another label. Uh, a paper on a much st uh, sturdier or uh, something like that and then I mounted the uh, that label paper on uh, my usual uh, chipboard two millimeters chipboard so I made these uh, these counters I still have the original ones um, uh, I said I'm sorry <laughs> Brian Train I said I'm sorry I won't be distributing the the files of course they are for my uh, uh, for my uh, personal use only but I had to do it because otherwise uh, I would have lost the counters uh, you can see some of them are uh, they they began to disintegrate so this is before the the scan so this is the scanned uh, picture with them disintegrating uh, I hold them dearly because I really like this game this is a nice nice uh interesting take uh on uh, civil unrest and uh, riots and stuff like that um we have uh, the police and the mob the police are blue um uh, with, uh, they have blue counters and the mob uh, has uh, orange reddish counters different type of units uh, some of our tongue in cheek. I really like this one. Uh, th these are uh, so called uh, uh, agitators. So it's a nice touch using uh, the famous Che Guevara, uh, the picture of Che Guevara as, a, as an agitator. And uh, and then we have, uh, I can't seem to find the helicopters, and uh, there are donut wagons for police, so we have some uh, tongue-in-cheek elements. But uh, all in all, it's, uh, it's a really interesting game, so we have police and uh, mob, and then we have uh, different type of uh, other cheats like uh, gas, clouds, tear gas, canisters, suppression counters barricades tv crew with some sort of machine gun on the, on the back we have another tv crew around here somewhere maybe here no or here no or here no no oh, somewhere around there we have fire markers um molotov cocktails 
Uh, and then, of course, we have a rule book. Um, this is a very uh, densely packed so uh, rule book, but very in a clear way, uh, established in a clear way to for six, seven pages, sort of the rules. And then we have uh, uh, scenarios, three types of scenarios. So we have uh, one, two, three pages, three pages of scenarios. This is a point point based system. So you have a starting point uh, points for the police, starting points for the mob. You have uh, you can uh, buy um, um, units and stuff like that using those points, and then you have to uh, confront on the maps on the one or on one on the other or uh, both maps. Uh, um, uh, placed in uh, which whichever uh, way you want to. Um, so we have uh, three types of uh, scenarios: riot scenarios, most of them uh, historical, New, uh, New York, Chicago, Seoul, Belfast. Then uh, the second type of uh, scenario are raids, like a house in West Berlin and or a crack house in New York City and then uh, uh, type 3 scenarios were in the ghetto uh, in LA Rodney King live uh, LA 92-89 Warsaw 44 and uh, Gaza in the first intifada 87 um, each with uh, some sort of um, uh, special rules for, uh, for uh, uh, this game and then Another uh, another sheet of paper with the forces available, which are useful to identify those because you don't have uh, names. Uh, you can identify this this being, I presume, the SWAT unit because it has ten one five four. So fire, fire, shock, uh, m morale, and movement. Fire. Oh, oh. So we have fire, shock, morale, and uh, movement. Um, with each with uh, the point cost, and then uh, we have combat result table for fire combat, shock combat, uh, combat modifiers, terrain table, move reinforcements, and even wind because you need the wind in some scenarios to to uh, to see whether the gas moves, gas clouds, tear gas clouds move, uh, uh, in which di direction they move. Uh, from turn to turn. So, uh, this was uh, long overdue. I uh, really like this game. Um, it's small, it's uh, in a theme that I haven't seen very much. Um, now I had the time to to do a show and tell. Uh, hope I, I hope uh, I haven't uh, rambled too much. Uh, Thank you for watching, uh, stay safe and uh, goodbye.